Who's that Pokemon? Who is that Pokemon? It's Mikachu. It's Mikachu. Oh, no. Oh, no. Let me turn that off real quick. It's Chris. Fuck! Fuck! Nobody wanted this. <laughs> We're sitting a bit differently today, and I can't tell how the audio is going. So, of course, I'm going to be paranoid. Please let us know. Well, when I yelled, who's that Pokemon, I got into the red. Well, you want to get into the yellow, Mikey. Yes. The goal is always perpetually yellow. The but thing also is, I'm, doesn't I'm, tell you anything about the quality of the sound. That's the opposite of me, because I'm, I'm either very loud or very quiet. Yes. This is why I tell you. It's just Hello, like my personality. Boys. Hello, if anybody's out there. I'm, I'm either very reserved and subdued, or I am like laser light show. Pew, pew, pew. Hello, I don't know if anybody's out there watching, but today we are playing a game called TikTok A Tale for Two. And it requires Mikey and me, I'm me, this is Mikey, to be looking at it from different computer screens and mm. talking to each other and communicating in order to, I think, solve some puzzles. So I've got my little iPad with another copy of it going on. And I think it tells a nice little story and we should be able to finish the whole game over the course of the stream. So mm. it should be fun. I, I wonder if this is uh, where Kesha got the idea for her song. I think so. I mean, this is, I think, the first time it was used. Hey Sid. hey, Sid. Nearly had us playing Keep Talking and Nobody Splodes, but then I decided, no, I want a chill out time. Why is that on paper? Well, because you don't, it's easier to use on paper than it is to flip oh, through things. Okay, it's a tabletop RPG. No, you have a bomb, yes. and I would have the instructions. I and we'd have see, to talk I to see, each I other see, and I have see. to look see. things up and we'd have to communicate. This time we'll have to communicate a different way. It, I have never actually played Keep Talking, but I've seen people play it. It looks quite excellent. But I decided I wanted something low stress today. Mm. Tick tock oh. on the clock. Well, how are DJ you doing now, blow Sid? my speakers up. Big day. Oh, by the way, Chris, thanks for your excellent input in the Discord thread today. I am very much yes. in agreement. It was an interesting ch conversation happening. Because for this game, Chris will be looking at a different screen. I am going to have to be the shepherd of the chat. Yes. Uh, thank you, Sid. Your contrib contributions were also great, of course. Um, ah, it was a it was a big conversation in the cross court today mm. about certain words that are with and whether they're appropriate for crosswords or not. Yeah. Ah, okay. Cool. Exactly. <laughs> what makes you think I don't lurk on your precious cross cord? I don't. I don't even know how I would do that. <laughs> All right. So hit start whenever you're ready. We're mm, in the thing okay. now. Let me uh. Put my phone somewhere where it won't be in the way. Okay. Tick tock, a tale for two. And let me know if I'm in camera or not, or what. You're in camera. Okay. This is a two-player adventure. Going solo is not an option. Pick a different player each and communicate to solve puzzles, either in person or through phone call online chat. The game itself doesn't require an internet connection to play. For the best experience, don't look at each other's screens. But if you get stuck and need a hint, then it doesn't hurt to take a peek. Okay, I'm looking right now. But I just went through all this. You can click, drag, spin, and use the mouse wheel to explore the world. We've got to make it so that the mouse isn't as audible on the stream. Wow. There's a lot of scraping sounds. But, yeah. It's because we don't have a, like a, well, a mouse pad. Well, we yeah. don't have a mouse pad there, no. If you're calling through an online chat, we recommend that you use Discord. It's also a great place to find a second player if you need one. Yeah, Discord. Nearly did this through Discord. You can be player one. Sure. I shall be player two. Make sure your team member is player two. Are you done? Are you player two? I am player two. I will hit start playing. All right, I can hear the audio from your game and not from mine. And right I don't on. think that matters, but we'll see. Well, Sid loves these kind of games. Today, you and your friend received two strange packages. Each contained an old clock. That's not what mine says. Oh, whoops. Maybe I should uh, not have said that out loud. Mine says you received a package from someone named Amelie Raven, and your friend got one too. Okay. So, my uh, Amelie Raven? Yeah, they signed a note on mine. Okay, yeah, they have a note as well. And, and I heard you say Emily, but it is Amelie. Amelie. No, I said Amelie. Um, well, Amelie. Amelie. 
This clock is part of the game, a gift I made for my sister. To have a fighting chance, play with a friend, and tell each other what you read and see. If you find my sister, tell her I miss her. Oh, dear player two, I sent one clock to you <laughs> and one to your friend. If you want oh, to... Chris, the desktop audio is not going through. Oh, that or it's too, it's too quiet for it to be heard. No, it's it's off right now. Uh, I'll get it. Okay. Oh, I forgot to turn it back on. That's the thing. Oh, all the lovely music, all that was. You missed a few heard. very nice piano chords. Sorry about that. Nice, nice, be... dreamy piano chords. Thank you for it's, the heads it's up. It's just little whooshing noises right now. <laughs> spelling the assistant design. Spelling bee just came on. Um, yeah, right now it's just sort of ambient. It's sound. just a small whoosh. Yeah. Anyway, um, if you want to play a game, look. <laughs> <laughs> no, you have to. I see. We already have the blessing of the if queen. If you want to play a game, look into the past together. Remember to wind the clocks up. Signed, Amelie. Okay. So uh, my clock says it's the thirty-first. It says it's today. Well, that's your March clock. Twenty twenty-one. That's not. Yeah, no. I'm just. I'm just. That's I'm, not the clock. I'm she telling sent. you what I see. Yes, I am also at three thirty-one, twenty twenty-one. So the box which came is from today's date. Yeah, after all, yeah, the, the box came from Denmark. Mm-hmm. And there's a little note inside. Uh, it looks like a newspaper clip. Yep, and there's a clock, and it's a watch, and it's engraved Lerka, 1917 to 1937. No, Amelie, 1915 to... No. Amelie's still alive. Okay. Oh, just 1915 to? Yeah, 1915 dash no, no end date. Amelie's real old, man. Perhaps. She's got 105. I've got old friends. Well, what is your newspaper... Oh. Yeah, no, don't mean to be a bother, but it's still no in-game audio. No, there is no in-game audio. It's there. just a gentle hushing. There, there, ha- there has not been a sound since we got to this screen. If it's just a gentle, very quiet running of water. Which Every now and again, I, I see on the monitor here, it just very slightly creeps up when the whoosh is at its most intense, which is not at all very intense. Yeah. So what is your... Uh, what is your Another disappearance struck... Xar Village, Tuesday, March 14th, 1937. Okay. Read the article. Uh, uh, it's by Mark D. Hansen. Um, youngest member of the Nid Clockmaker family was reported missing. Amelie told us she, her at 1030. Okay. Is that the whole thing? Yep. Understandably distressed, she later corrected her statement and said it must have been an hour and a half later. Contact. If you have seen or heard anything unusual, please contact the police. Okay, a lot of mine is cut off. Yeah, well, mine cut off nicely at a paragraph, but it does look like there's a few letters missing from yours. Mm-hmm. Oted, noted. Yes. And then if I... Oh, I can open up the clock, and it's broken. Did you hear those ticks, Sid? Lots of clicks. Oh, that's when you're clicking. Yeah. No, oh. but it's it's the it's the game audio. Like, you can see it peeking on the monitor. When yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I know. Yeah. Um, I just can't see you doing it because oh, I can't so I can, see Oh, shit. I probably shouldn't have done that. It, right now, it's 6.15, and uh, I can absolutely move the hands of the watch. All right. Mine says came at uh, 7 o'clock on the dot. And so yours was 6.15? Mm-hmm. What, uh, what time did she say it was on yours? 10.30. But then she later corrected her statement to say it was... Uh, half later. An hour and a half later. Well, it said rewind the clock, right? Yes. So I'm just rewinding it a lot to no such particular place. I'm going to rewind mine. Also, is yours broken? What do you mean? Well, my my, my face has a big crack in no, it. No, mine, mine is not broken. Oh. Maybe it's because Amelie's alive. That's possible. All right, what time? So we said so I, was... I wound it to 11, 11, nothing. But I'm going to put mine till 10.30. An hour and a half after the time that they said there? Yeah, which would be 12. Oh, I'm going to put it on 12 then. Yeah. 12. Nothing happened? Nothing happened. Hmm. Let's see. Tell my sister I miss her. Pull it back to 10. Oh, I can pick up this paperclip. Oh, yeah, there's a paperclip. Oh, you can also wind the clock. How so? By turning the little dial on top. Oh, of course. The crown. And there's an eraser on my desk. Yeah, I have an eraser as well. But I can't seem to do anything with it. I was able to pick up the paperclip once, and I dropped it in shock, and I have not been able to pick it up again. I wonder if I'm winding this. Is is there a right way to wind a watch? Is it like righty-tighty, lefty-loosey? Yeah. I'm doing righty-tighty. But nothing's happening. 
Does it make the little winding noise each time? Yeah. Have the little gears started moving? Nope. Hmm. Let's see. Hmm. Hmm. I, I, I swear, I could, I could click on this paper clip. Yeah, I'm clicking on it and it just moves, but it doesn't, I can't drag it anywhere. Interesting paper clips shape. Oh, the same thing yes. happens with the, um, with the, uh, eraser. Hmm. I can I can touch it, but I can't. I'm not Remember sure. to wind the clocks up. Okay. Yeah. So we're winding the clock. Oh. There we go. So what did I you do? I just put it to twelve and I wound it. I put it to twelve and then wound it. Yeah. Right. So both hands. Oh yeah, there we the go. Top. There yeah. we go. We're going through. We got a little whirlpool effect. Chapter one. This is a copy I made of the world that Lerk and I. Lerka. Let's say Lerka. Lerka and I used to know. Lerka went missing in 1960. Sorry, chapter one. Lerka went missing in 1937, but it all started years before. Okay. 2021, 20, and we're winding back. Yeah, the we're clock. winding back the clock. To 1927. That's what I got as well. And we've got a scene with a, a clock and what looks like a. What is that? It's a. It's got a train and it's got a little whoa, crown whoa. on it. All right, I'm gonna check out this machine. Yeah, I've got a machine with a. It's, got a train it's missing corner. a button. Mm -hmm. It has up, down, left, but no right, and then there's a reset. Yeah, I've got the same thing, and it's. And if I click on it, I move in. Yes. So yeah. I can make the train move, as, as you would think, but it's gonna be stuck on the left. My my train started at the bottom left, and it's gonna be stuck on the left margin exactly. because my right button sh is not there. Exactly. Okay. Same problem here, Mikey. Okay. Let's see. And there's a clock. It is twelve o'clock as well. There are train. There's train tracks in the distance, actually, as well. There are. I can't seem to. Oh, there's a bird. Then there's by. Raven's clocks. If I. Raven's clocks. What? Yeah. If I if I I, I went back out and then I'm just like looking around. Like yeah, if I turn my oh. turn my field of view. There's a raven, and I can click on an actual raven. raven. Yeah, an actual vampire. Oh, oh, you can turn the thing. Raven. Oh, there's Raven's clocks. There's also a well with a opening hours path. three to nine. With a yes. um, a, a path lit by lanterns to a well. And a and house. There's a house, with crocuses or something. And that's it. So there are four. Th there are four things. I moved to the house, okay, and there's gonna, a little jack in the box. I'm gonna go to the house as well. There's a train here. And a light. A light that I can turn on. Which oh, oh. It attracted a moth, and the moth left some text as it flew. Okay. Lerka hope like present. The it, moth said that. No, it. There's spaces like there are missing words. Okay. It's not the clock. It's a light bulb and a train. If you go to the house, there's a. Inside, like it took me inside the house, and there's a toy train and a light bulb. And I turn on the light bulb, and a moth flew to it. Okay. Lerka hope like present. It three clockwise, anti-clockwise, then turning clockwise and not go. Oh, hold on, say that again. Lerka hope. No, no, not that part. It three clockwise, anti-clockwise. Clock three. Wait, three clockwise, then anti-clockwise. Well, there are words missing. I'm assuming that there's a number of anti-clockwise that you will tell me. All right. So hold on. Where is this? It's in the house. In the house. In the house is the jack in the box. There's no jack in the box. Well, I've got a jack in the box that has a candle on it that I can crank clockwise or anti-clockwise. Well, okay, then do three clockwise cranks. One, two, three. Okay, and then? Anti-clockwise. Anti-clockwise. Then turning clockwise and not go. Uh-huh, turning clockwise and not go? And your guess is as good as mine. There are very important words missing. All right, well, that... So I've got... Um... In addition to the jack-in-the-box, mm -hmm. I've got a shadow of an empty birdcage. Oh! Oh! No, I've got it here. So when I when I turned the wheel on the... It's a steam locomotive. Okay. And it filled in it filled in the words. I accidentally looked at your screen. But anyway. Lerica, I hope you like your present. Turn it anti-clockwise three times, clockwise twice, anti-clockwise twice, then keep turning it clockwise. Oh, and do not let go. Okay, ready? I think... Yeah, I got it. You got it? Yep, it popped out, a little jack-in-the-box popped out, and a little ticket that has something like the train thing on it came out with the number 67 on it. <laughs> no, Sid asks if we do anti-clockwise or counterclockwise. We do counterclockwise. 
Okay, and I guess I have to leave that on the floor while we look for the other half of the gift. 67 is the number on the ticket, eh? Yes. Six, oh, if I click on the bushes, they shake. Oh, yeah, they do. I don't know if there's anything to that. This game isn't doesn't seem to be a hidden pixel thing. Uh, what's in the well? Okay. Okay, we can go down the well. Down yes. the well. There's vines and leaves. And then there's like a little puzzle contraption thing. Right. With six things and a few buttons. Yeah, so there are there are six pictures of symbols. There are three buttons and three not buttons. That All are right. little uh, diamond squares. So if we do one, two, three, top row, four, five, six, bottom row, mm -hmm. black triangle, black square, white triangle, white triangle, the white square, white triangle. Oh, sorry, white square. My top row are all circles. Oh. So white circle, white circle, black circle. And the bottom is white triangle. Sorry, Jesus. White square, white triangle, black circle. Now, I have buttons on two, four, and six. I have one, three, five. Oh. All right. If I hit the button for two, mm -hmm. it goes from black square to white square mm -hmm. to black triangle. Okay. So maybe they need to match. Maybe. Okay, yeah, so... Uh, yeah. So make number one, mm -hmm. number one black triangle. Oh, shit, I was just on black triangle and I clicked well, away from it as you said that. I can't jump. Okay, mm -hmm. What's number two? Is a white circle. Okay, number three, white yes. triangle. Okay, number four is a white square. Okay, number five, white square. Chris is on his iPad. Yes, hi. I'm on the iPad. What, what was number four, sorry? Number five is number white five, square. Right. White square? Okay. White square. There we white are. White square. And the last one is a black circle. Okay, black circle. And now pull the crank, and it seems to have opened. Yes. And there's the button. Yeah. I have button. Excellent. It's I guess in that's my in my inventory. So I'm going to leave the thing. Oop. The mouse wheel is much better than clicking and dragging to get to the top. Go back. Oh, you don't have a mouse wheel. Yeah, I don't. Right. I'm doing a touch interface. Okay. I'm going to pop my... Going to go to Raven's Clocks? Or... Well, I was going to pop in the uh, button first. Okay, sure, sure. And now that's set. And now we'll go to Raven's Clocks, see if we can figure out the other half of that ticket. Oh, it's not open yet. Opening hours three to nine. Hmm. What could? Well, we can. Can we change the clock at the train station, perhaps? I no, we can't. So. No. It's one o'clock now. I have it at midnight still. You have it at midnight? That's what. Uh, when I'm at the uh, train station, the the. Did you put in your button yet? Yes. Huh. Yeah, mine says one o'clock. Hmm. Little hand on the one, big hand on the XII. Both, both hands are meeting at the top. Hmm. Okay. Curious. I'm gonna go to Raven's Clock, see what I see. It does look closed. Yeah, three to nine is the opening hours I have. Yeah. All right, let me uh, go and look again at the... Um... Actually, can you go back and look at... Oh, no, I have the ticket. Mm-hmm. 67, it said. All right, go to the... Um... Go to your uh, your your train thing. Like the stop with the game. Yeah. Okay. Yes, I'm here. Okay. You ready? Mm-hmm. You and it's got all four buttons now, it right? It does. Yeah. So up, 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 right, 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 down, 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 right, right. Okay. Nothing seems to have happened. Well, that's all because it keeps going. Okay. Um. Any, can you tell me what that was again? It's up, 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 right, up, right. right, 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 down, down, right. Okay. So that's the first half of that. Ah, huh, I wonder why it's an hour different. Three and nine. How do we? Hmm. Is the desktop audio going through? There's nothing happening now. It's just no. There's 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 little creaks and. There's ambient sounds. I mean, it's incredibly quiet, but I don't yeah, know. Yeah, it's true. Make it go clicky-click or something. I, I I just saw it peak a little bit, so it's very quiet. 
I might actually turn it up a little. Sure. Well, that's going to cause it all to go away, of course. Yes, but that's okay. You can come back. All right. Uh, I'm going back in the house. Is there anything else, I wonder? If I leave the screen... No, there's nothing. No, it's it's still it still remains there. I don't. Was, oh, oh, it's one o'clock now. Oh, it's midnight here. <laughs> now, where did you go? I didn't go anywhere. I, I just I I came back from. I was I was zoomed in on the train, and then when I came back out of the train, it was one. All right, I'm gonna go into the well again. Okay. Go into the house. I'm gonna come out of the well. And oh, that's you. Alright, it's still midnight. What are you doing? I just went into the house to see if anything had changed. Go to the house. Nothing had changed in the Leave house. Leave the house. Check the clock. Now it's 11. Huh. Alright, go to the. Wait! Wait! What? what? Okay, Mikey. Yes. yes. When you spin around the world, you're moving the clock. <laughs> oh, maybe. Trust me. Okay, I'm, I'm gonna go to the right and see what happens. It's, it's one. Nine o'clock. The Ravens' clocks is open. Oh, uh, it made it two. Yeah, you gotta go anti-clockwise. That made it three. Ravens' clock was open at three. All right, you can do it that way too. Good discovery. Okay, there's a. I see a, a radio. I think. Yep, there's a radio with different, um, you know, bandwidth band. band Five twenty-five to seventeen oh five. Oh, have. I see, and it's coming into, and it's causing the letters to scramble when I turn it. Yes. To be able to open their clock oh, shop oh. today, the eighteenth, at about uh, one thousand on the band. I have uh, ar around eight twenty, just before. The oldest raven daughter, Amelie, is a brilliant clockmaker and inventor. Her, f her footsteps. All right. Oh, okay. The one after, so around five, or around 600. Yep. Missing, mostly old cats and dogs. Let's hope they're all found soon. Then around 800 are usually followed by... Oh, 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 hold on. Don't. Uh, no, because I have the first half of the one at 600. Okay. So, last month, the police started getting several reports of pets going... Missing. Mostly old cats and dogs. Let's hope they're all found soon. So, around 800? Yeah. The oldest raven daughter, Amelie, is a brilliant clockmaker and inventor. Her footsteps... Are usually followed by the ticking and scuttling of one of her creations. Okay. And then around... around I guess halfway between yep, 820 yep, and 1115. Yep. The raven family moved here a month ago ago and have worked day and night to be able to open their clock shop today the 18th then just past 11 15 another pet has been stolen during the night this time it was mrs jensen's sweet old farm dog remember to lock your doors until this thief has been caught then just before 1410 a strange occurrence has shook our village droves of lifeless birds have been found scattered across the forest floor Oh. No more walking for five miles to get your letters. It's now March, and the construction of our very own post office will start at the end of the month. One more. Uh huh. An unusual white raven seems attached to the youngest member of the Raven family. Let's hope for her sake that it will not go missing like those other pets. Well. There's also a little wind-up fly, which I've just clicked a few times, and it's going up the stairs now. It's a beetle of some sort. Yeah, I guess it's a beetle. Oh, and I can scroll up, and there's clocks. Oh, yes. It says private over the staircase. And then there's feathers on the ground. Oh, I scrolled up to the next floor. There's a scroll of some sort. There's a news newspaper. News Wednesday edition. In Raven's Clock Shop, you can buy all kinds of clockwork, request commissions, and get your old clock repaired. Today, a grand opening of Clock Shop. First column. The world-renowned clockmaker, Mr. Raven, has opened a new clock shop in our town. He is said to be an interesting... I don't have anything. You don't have two columns of text on this? I don't have anything at all. You just have an empty scroll? It's, I can't open it up. What do you mean? Oh, you have... Go up. Is there something hanging on the wall? 
there's a calendar. It's the 1st of January, 1927. Oh, right. That's at the top of the screen. There's like yeah. a, a circular porthole next to no. it. No. Oh, all right. Well, all right. That's the end of the first column. And that says, the level of detail is exquisite. Our own queen is said to have a couple of his elegant pieces. Today he is opening his. And there's a picture of Raven's clock. There are also some clocks sort of at the above the radio. Yeah, above the radio there's some clocks, and then I get to the next floor where there's a rolled up something on the floor, which I can click and it, it just moves a little, but it doesn't open up. And then I go to the top, it is January 1927, Sunday, the first, and I can't manipulate... Wait, oh, I can change it. I can change it to Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. Oh, I can change the date. January? Oh, I can change the date to anything. Isn't it supposed to open in March? Well, I, give me a date. Because I, I can change all the months. And I can... It was just set to the 1st of January, but I can change the months. I can change the days of the, the week. Uh, all right, the clock shop opens today, the 18th. Okay, 18th, and it was a March. I thought right. it said March. Sunday, Monday... Sunday, Monday... It's a Wednesday. And it's supposed to be Wednesday. Yeah, there we go. And that opened it. Great. So inside there is, oh, the second half of the train plan. Ah. Which is, um... Hold on, I'll go back to the train and we can, I'll enter it. Okay, sure. Um, okay. It is, uh, so you've got... So we're at the bottom yeah. of column five. So go up, up, up. Okay. Right, right. Uh-huh. Up, Right. Okay. And that should leave you at the far right margin, one below the top. Okay, that's where I'm at. Okay. Oh, and the train's here. Cool. So I've also got Gulliver's Travels, watchmaking, um, some sort of item, some mechanical things that I can... A glass bottle. They make some nice foley, but I can't seem to pick them up. Nice compass. Uh -huh. Longitude, the nightingale. So... There's nothing else inside of here. No. Well, oh, I just hit the train and I was able to go to chapter two, so. Oh, well, I mean, I might have needed you to give me the instructions for the second half of that I map. Know, but you didn't want to go to the train. Well, I was making sure I, I didn't miss anything. I Could you remember. please tell me? It was up, up. You're going one higher than the previous one. Okay. Mm hmm. Then you're going over. Yeah, I remember it. Okay, good. And then if you back out, the train mm -hmm. should be there. Yep. There we go. Chapter two. It was getting harder to find animals for my experiments, but I still... Oh, she's the one who's kidnapping animals. Uh-oh. But I still knew one I could get access to easily. Did right. you get text for chapter, chapter two? Chapter two. I told Lerka I was busy making her a clock... But she wasn't interested. She, she was too busy playing with her stupid bird. 1931, Attention, closed track. Out of office. Service. You're right, service. All right. And it's raining. And it's raining. Raven's clocks is still there. Yeah, there's the uh, a, house. A, a, a trumpet? A horn, rather. A yeah, horn. French horn. And uh, the house is still there. Yes. I've made it 1 o'clock. And I've made it 11. I'm going to go in the house. Okay. Let's do the house first. So there's a burning fire. I've got a bunch of bells that I can ring for the kitchen, front door, sturdy, music room, office, dining hall. And there's a door and a plant with a little note underneath it. Ooh, let's see what that note says. There's a note underneath the plant that says, like a potted plant, mm -hmm. I left you something downstairs. It will be my greatest invention yet. Play our secret melody and I'll open the door. Signed, Amelie. So I, I can't look left to right inside, but I am uh, to, no, I am right. The, the potted plant is on the left margin of my screen and there is a door that goes downstairs, which I can open. And I can go downstairs. And I'm in the basement and there's there's a lot of things. I'm not sure... I'm going to turn my sound on. Oh! Oh, I clicked on some rope, and uh, it fell down, and there's text on it. Okay. It really well, like you did with the two kittens you found in the pantry. So clearly, you get the first half of that. Uh, well, I can't go down anywhere. 
Well, I'm in the basement. Oh, well, okay. I can I can move the pots around. I can move a pot around. Mm-hmm. And slide it back and forth. I can slide this bottle back and forth. Is there anything that gives me a melody or a list of rooms? No. Or... Oh, I can move this glass back and forth. Oh, and there's a there's a. Oh. Okay, there there was. Well, okay, there's a melody for you. Uh, there is a there is a lizard who was behind one of the glass bottles. When I moved it, it ran to the next glass bottle, and when I moved that glass bottle, it ran down into a cage. And okay. there's text. All right. In five years, when I've gained more knowledge, I'll come back and complete it. I'll be sitting by the dinner table waiting for you. Okay. Oh, and I uncorked this bottle of uh, this uh this um barrel, and a bunch of words fell out. Okay. Oh. And now they've all come together. Okay, I've got the full text. All right. <laughs> I've been working on this iteration for one year now in the study. I'd like you to keep it safe from me, Lerka. Look after it really well, like you did with the two kittens you found in the pantry. In five years, when I've gained more knowledge, I'll come back and complete it. I'll be sitting by the dinner table waiting for you. So she made some sort of thing that Lerka had to keep safe for her. She's going to be gone away for five years. I'm sorry to report I don't have any melody for you. However, well, there's maybe... also rooms, and you've mentioned a few rooms. I couldn't but... go into any rooms. No, but they were in the note. Yes. So each of the notes that I have is, a, is it has a label. Oh, room, oh, I see. I was about to go into the horn store to see if there's front any music door, there. Kitchen, study, horn, music room, office, dining hall. Ready? Sure. Okay, let's see. Study. Pantry. See, there's kitchen. Uh, dinner table, I guess. Dining hall. Hmm. Did I leave one out? Front door, music room, office. No. I've been working on this iteration for one year now in the study. Hold on. Pay That's attention. what happens when I try to... Yeah. So, li listen, listen for words. Okay. I've been working on this iteration for one year now in the study. Uh-huh. I'd like you to keep it safe from me, Lerka. Look after it really well, like you did with the two kittens you found in the pantry. Right. In five years, when I've gained more knowledge, I'll come back and complete it. I'll be sitting by the dinner table waiting for you. Now, it might be worth saying that this text is broken up into three paragraphs in a very strange way. Like, there's some real, there's some real odd enjambment. Ah, uh, so maybe it's not complete? No, I mean, if it's incomplete, it's, it's in such a way that, like, it's, it's making complete sentences. All right, I think we should explore elsewhere since that yes. seems to be a dead end right now. So let's check out Horny House. So I have 44, 46, 48. Oh. All right. Well, I've got um, a mailbox with mm -hmm. a crown on it that says Post Brevkas. Oh. And it's got a map of Denmark and some rolled up pieces of paper. And I can scroll up. So I, I basically have the mail. I guess these are these are mail slots: 14, 16, 18, 24, 26, 28, 34, 36, 38, 44, 46, 48. So okay, I've got. They look like post office boxes. I don't seem to have any way of interacting with my side of the post office. I have a mechanical beetle here, like before. Oh, Let me okay. just wind it up, and then it'll take and you off to a new direction. It's climbing up. And it climbed off the top of the screen. Yeah, so that usually means you can go up. No, I I'm, I'm at the to very top. I followed it up. Oh, uh, yeah, but that's what it means. It means. But like, I, I'm at the top of my scrolling. I won't scroll any further. Yes, but was it at the bottom of the screen? Yeah. So it's an indication telling you that you can scroll up. I mean, in the last chapter, it went up the stairs. Yes, indicating that I could scroll up. Yes, well, I can't. That scroll is a way up. of indicating to the player, hey, maybe you should scroll up. I could click on the buttons in front of each of these mailboxes. Okay. But nothing appears to happen when I do. I'm just going to try all of them. Oh, oh, oh! There's a there's a four-handed clock on, on each of them that I can manipulate the hands. A four-handed clock? If you want to take a peek. Four-handed So it looks like a compass, clock. but you see, I can, I can move the hands. Okay. Well, I don't know what you're supposed to do with that. Neither do I. I do have mm -hmm. four, I mean, this doesn't seem like it's a thing, but I do have four tubes that are, in, in a, you know, that are arranged in a way, but I don't think that's what it is. No. 
I mean, maybe, but that would be weird. I don't even know which one of these boxes I'm meant to be aiming for. So I've left. There's nothing else yeah, I can do. Yeah, I'm going to go to Raven's, Raven's Clocks. Clocks. I need to make it so that it's open. Yeah. Spin around and around and around and around, and now the clock store is there. Yeah. Ah, okay. Apprenticeship. <clears throat> There's a white raven. Uh huh. Just a whole raven. A whole white raven. I've it's... got a picture of a raven on the girl's shoulder. The the white raven does not appear to be mechanical. It appears to be biological. Okay, this is also, I mean, mine's a photograph. I've got a key that says clock shop on it, which is now in my inventory. Mm -hmm. uh, let's see. Do not remove these tools. I will work when the clock shop is closed. I've got a envelope leaning up against a lamp. And it says Amelie Raven on it. And you can see inside it, there is a key. So there's also framed on the wall uh -huh. a certificate. Apprenticeship. Dear Amelie, I am pleased to inform you that you have been chosen as my new apprentice. Your experiments with time extractions are truly groundbreaking. I agree that our short lifespan is deeply unfair, especially for people like us who keep improving the world, pushing it for forward. I am looking forward to helping you with your experiment in Switzerland. Yours sincerely, Clarissa Shar, Master Watchmaker. Oh my. And there are two books here. One is called Creating Automatons. Uh -huh. So maybe the Raven is just a very good automaton. Maybe. And Extracting Time. Right. There are also three marbles, a cat's eye, a white one, and a red one. Okay. Um, can you take I can... any of these things? No, I can click on them, but nothing happens. There are... There's a... I can't... Well, there's a couple of shelves... <laughs> What happens if I click on the raven? Nothing. Right. Can I scroll anywhere? No. Also, there's a clock here, and the minute hand is just dingly dangling back and forth between a few, you mm. know, not, not moving anywhere, but just moving up and down. Mm. Now, if I go to uh -huh. the post office. Yes. Um, I've got my, uh, there's a mailbox here, and I've got this letter. Mm-hmm. Oh, it won't let me access it. Okay, maybe that's... Oh, no, there we go. I have mailed the letter. Okay. And... Okay, okay, Mikey, I've got a code. Okay. Mm -hmm. So go to the post boxes. Okay, great. Hold on. Yes. Is there one in particular? Yes, number 28, please. 28. Okay. Mm-hmm. That... 28 was our P.O. Box number all, all my childhood. <laughs> oh, very good. For number 28, you yeah. want to go northwest. Northwest. Hold on. I I have east-west trouble sometimes. Okay, northwest. West. West, yep. Southwest. Southwest. And east. East, okay. So it makes a very nice sort of like, uh, looks like the Newfoundland Side flag. Side sure, yes. Sideways peace sign. It opened. Excellent. There's a letter for Amelie Raven. Okay. And it has two Denmark posts from Lerica. Uh huh. Here's your key to the shop, clock shop, Amelie. Oh. When you're done working, could you help me look for my raven, Lerica? Oh, that's nice. And I got the key into my. Yeah, I have a key to the clock shop in my inventory as well. Um, wonder. I wonder. I'm going back into the that. clock shop. I don't think there's anything I can use this key for. Well, you could probably... Maybe we can use it when it's closed. Mm. Oh, that's true. It does say... The letter here says, Do not remove these tools. I will work when the clock shop is closed. So let me just... Okay. Travel through time until the clock shop is closed. Yes, I've done that. I've entered the clock shop. Oh, and now there's more. there's more books here. Okay. I use the key. Oh, there's a book. Oh. All right, what have you got? There's a there's a clock and it's open. I'm seeing its guts. Where were those stones? They they were on the uh, table. Now they are inside the uh, clock. And the raven has come down and just nudged the clock with its beak. Okay, I've got mm -hmm. a book on gemstones that describes the different qualities of different stones. Okay. I don't know. It's got little paragraphs, but and then we've got a book called Horology: New Measures of Me Measuring Time by C. Shar. 
Mm-hmm. That's her master that she's apprenticed to, Clarissa Shar. Okay, and then there is a um, a chapter mm-hmm. for accuracy. Through multiple studies, Ms. Shar figured out that a timepiece would be more precise when using only quartz in the channeling plate. So right now there are uh, there are four. I called them marbles. Yes. Uh, arrayed. And they're all pointing down to a place where it looks like you would slot a fifth marble. Right. Which I don't have. No, don't worry about that. Listen, okay. you got to gotta let me say it, but that's good. Okay. Uh, so there's a, there's like, yes, um, there's a note that, uh, mm-hmm. that, that she's put in, that yeah. uh, Amelie has put in. Okay. I think this sequence will be more accurate with the additional benefit of storing time. Mm-hmm. And now it's a logic problem. Okay. So the tiger's eye should yeah. be to the left of the quartz. Okay. The malachite cannot be to the far sides or directly next to the ruby. Oh, okay. I see. The ruby must not be directly next to the tiger's eye. So it's 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 a logic puzzle, but it's also a spatial reasoning puzzle because I realize the slot the the empty slot, uh, I can slide these down on tracks. So I can move them from one position to another, oh, but I only see. in a in a very specific kind of way. So the the tiger's eye needs to be next to the quartz. Uh huh. The malachite cannot to the left be of the quartz. to the left of the quartz. Yeah. Fuck. Hold on. Hold on. You need to make it be. Yeah. Hold on. Hold on. The malachite. Sorry, the tiger's eye needs to be the left of the quartz. And the ruby can't be next to the malachite. No, the what? ruby must not be directly next to... Well, yes, the ruby can't be next to the... Okay, here we go. The ruby yeah. mm-hmm. cannot be next to the malachite or mm-hmm. next to the tiger's eye. Hold up. Shit. Hold on. Okay. So, okay, I see. I see. I see. How am I going to do this? Also, the white, the white raven's being really insistent. <laughs> so the ruby has to be at one yep. end, because yep. it can only be next to the tiger, or the, the quartz. Shit. How do I get it there? Ugh. And the quartz needs to be, then, if the quartz needs to be, needs to be ruby next to... Yeah, I think I got it. Okay. I don't got it. Okay. So, so okay, hold on, hold on. So I've got, I've got the cat's eye to the left of the quartz. Is that correct? Uh, the tiger's eye needs to be left of the quartz. Yeah. And I have the malachite can't be next to the tiger's eye or the ruby. The malachite cannot be on the edge, on one of the far sides. Uh-huh. Or directly next to the ruby. Okay, so it can be next to the tiger's eye or the cor- uh, or the quartz. Yeah. Okay, I misunderstood. Um, that's fine. Um, so it on. needs to be in one of the middle two. Mm-hmm. But if it needs to be... Oh, God. The ruby needs to be at the edge. Mm. This is the, the hard part, then. Hold up. So... The malachite can't be on the edge. The malachite can't be on the edge. Which means... I I don't see a way to have it that it's not next to the ruby, then. The ruby needs to be at the edge. Yes. So, if it were from the left... But, oh, hold on, hold on. The malachite... Tiger's eye, malachite... Sorry, say that, start over. Tiger's eye in yep. one, malachite yep. in two... No, sorry, tiger. Yeah, tiger's eye in one, malachite in two. Yeah, uh, quartz in three. Yep. and ruby in four. That's what I have. So you're thinking that the tiger's eye doesn't need to be adjacent to the quartz. It doesn't it just say needs it needs to be, to be left left. touching well, that, it. To the that's left. what I've done, and nothing's happened. Uh, okay. Maybe I'll leave this. No, that just left the clock shop altogether. The tiger's eye should be to the left of the quartz. The malachite cannot be to the far sides or directly next to the ruby. The ruby must not be directly next to the tiger's eye. So the ruby can only be next to the quartz. Hmm. 
This is a tough puzzle. Not really. The tiger's eye. Hold on. There's mm-hmm. more. Mm-hmm. So go back. To, go back to it. I'm. I'm at it. Now you've are, are the are the stones still in the same order? Yes. Okay. Um, for highest precision, point the balance needle. Do you have a balance needle? Yes. Towards the third quartz, and she, uh, Emily, inserts point it t- instead towards the malachite. Storms time better. Oh wait, I thought I had a balance needle, but I can't seem to turn it. Oh, I see. I can. I, I didn't see the mechanism. It wants to be pointed towards what? The malachite. The malachite. Okay. Mm-hmm. And now, the author says when everything is set up for optimal accuracy, you wind the clock up by turning the top right gear clockwise twice. But, she says, once the lid has closed, Mm -hmm. test the experiment by setting the clock to 12. This should initiate the extraction process. I can't seem to close the clock. Oh, all right. Then try turning the top right gear clockwise twice. There we go. And once it's closed, set it to 12. Yeah, hold on, hold on. That's a lot of a lot of spinning. Okay, yes. There we go. It worked. Oh, we're traveling through time. Oh god, the raven turned into smoke. The raven went into the clock. Okay. Well, now what? Are and you... now it's going back and forth between 12:15 and 12:30. And now it's spinning around and it's back to 12:15, 12:15, 12:15, 12:30. 12:15, 12:30. Uh-huh. So when I click it, when I click it, it, it gets bigger. Uh huh. But I can't do anything. Well, if I click again, it make it go small. So it's it's basically twelve thirty. Twelve sorry, twelve fifteen, twelve fifteen, twelve thirty, twelve fifteen, twelve thirty, twelve thirty, twelve fifteen, and then it does uh, two spins, and then it starts the sequence over. So it's a sequence. Of but, hmm, that's not what I was hoping for. Where are you, by the way? I'm, I'm in the clock shop still. Okay. Nothing happened. The raven just turned into smoke and went inside the clock. And you said it's 1215-ish? Uh, well, it's, uh, it's, not, not, it's not anything. Uh, eh. It's the, the, the minute hand will go to 1215. The minute hand can't go to a 1215. The, the, well, the, 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 uh, the hour hand is stuck at 12. It's not never moving. Okay. But the minute hand goes to 3-6. So it goes like three, three, six, three, six, six, three, and then it goes over. Okay, so three and six. I don't know. That's not quite what it would time it would be if I go to the Raven Clock House at that time. Yeah, mine is jumping between the eight and the nine. Okay. But all right, what if you leave there? Okay. Um. What if you go to the house? Okay. Has anything changed there? No. Nothing? Nope. Mm, what is the secret melody? Do the do the numbers correspond to rooms? There are bells and rooms. Yes. So it's not like three means a specific room. There's no three. They're in order, of course. So yes, I'm looking for anything in particular that might help me with that puzzle. I don't think we've got anything else with the with the map room. But you got nothing? No, I'm just looking around. All right. Well, if you go to the house, mm-hmm. what is the uh, and you go back to that note that you found or you were yeah. able to get? Uh huh. Why don't you read that again? 
I have been working on this iteration for one year now in the study. I'd like you to keep it safe, Mirlerica. Look after it really well, like you did with the two kittens you found in the pantry. In five years, when I've gained more knowledge, I'll come back and complete it. I'll be sitting by the dinner table waiting for you. What's that noise? That was that's our own stream. That's all. That's us. Oh, sorry. You're right. Um. Gosh, that really feels like. All right, say that again. Read it again. Sorry. I've been working on this iteration for one year now in the study. I'd like you to keep it safe for me, Lerica. Look after it really well, like you did with the two kittens you found in the pantry. In five years, when I've gained more knowledge, I'll come back and complete it. I'll be sitting by the dinner table waiting for you. I'll be sitting by the dinner table waiting for you. That note's for Lerica, though. Hmm... Can't make heads or tails of that. Uh, can't make heads or tails of that. Um, after five years, I'll be sitting by the dinner table. Let me look at what you've got. Let me see the house again. Oh, I see. So I had to uncoil this rope and unplug this and get that lizard into there to make these all appear. Right. Five years when I've gained more knowledge, I'll come back and complete it. Just I can also do this. I don't know if that's okay. If there's any point to those things, but well, there hasn't been anything that hasn't had a point before. But can you move anything else? Uh, no, not that I've discovered. Like I removed this, but it's it won't go back. Right. Okay. Go back up. with what's on the other shelves? Can you open any of those things? Nope. Okay. And there you've got, you can't do anything with the wood, isn't that weird? And, huh, would you like um. to see the shop? Mikey, that's a. What's that code doing? I told you it's a sequence. It's three 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 six three six six three. Three 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 six three six six three. Spin around. Yeah. Oh. All right. Sorry, I didn't realize that that was not what you were describing to me, or not how I could picture it. Um. What do I have that could do that? I guess I could make the entire thing do that. Like that. All right. So what is So it's starting at three. All right. So it's two o'clock. And if I go that way, that way, that way, that way, it's now three o'clock. So that's going to be. So it. how many times does it swirl around before it starts? Um. So at the end of the sequence, all the seconds about to happen. Two. And then it goes to the three? Yeah, and then it goes three, three, three. three. Wait, what does it do when it's at three? It pauses. And then it, how does it? It pulses. Here it starts over. Three. One. Three. And it decides to actually stay at three and stay at three. So three, three, three. Yep. Then six. Six. Oh, starting over. So three, 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 
six three six six three. That didn't do anything. I spun it, myself around that way. Is there a mathematical um, thing going on here? Like re the relationship between threes and sixes? It's three, 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 six, three, six, six, three. I don't think so. All right, I'm looking up a hint. Mm hmm. It, it adds up to 33. I wonder what happens if I come back when the shop's open. Hey, it's open. Whoop. Oh, God. Hold on. No, nothing. Hey, Mikey? Yeah? Have you seen a barrel? Mm, there's one in the basement of the house. Okay, go into the basement of the house into the barrel. Mm -hmm. Hit that barrel a few more times. Is there another barrel? Mm -hmm. This is the one that I had to take the plug out of. There hasn't been another barrel that I've seen. It's not a barrel at the train station. I can still draw routes on the train station, on the mm -hmm. train. I don't know what happens if I drop the There's no one. hanging barrel. No. Oh, oh, okay. All right, so read the note again. Hold on a second, I'm just curious. All right, that's fine. Nope, out of service. Uh, in the house, isn't it? Oh, sorry, you wanted that note. There's also, there's no, there's no, no there's several notes. Yeah, I want, the, I want the note about the, about the, the note that you found. Mm-hmm. Okay. I've been working on this iteration for one year now in the study. So, one in the study? Mm hmm Okay. I'd like you to keep it safe from your Lurka. Look after it really well, like you did with the two kittens you found in the pantry. So, two kitchens. Mm -hmm. Or pantry. Mm -hmm. In five years, I'll have gained more knowledge. I'll come back and complete it. I'll be sitting by the dinner table. So, five, five years. Five dinner tables. Yeah. And the door yeah. opened. That was the trick. Cool. We could have figured that. And I, out. Well, he could have, but that's a weird clue. So then, now I can go downstairs, and I've got the hanging barrel with the plug in it, which I hit a couple times. You just got to remove the plug. No, no, no. There's no plug in it. It used to have a plug in mm. it. And now I'm breaking this barrel apart. And if I break it apart, I get a clock inside it, and that's where I, I saw it. And now it's bouncing around from time to time, and those little lights are growing up, just like you. Mm -hmm. But I have a different pattern. Okay. Hey. Um, 12, 13, 12, sorry, 3, 12, 12, th I don't know how to, oh, so I can't control it. No. So my pattern is 12, 3, 12, 12, 12, 3, 6, spin around, 12, 3, 12, 12, 12, 3, 6. Is it also, um... Oh, you know what, Mikey? What? These are the train codes. Because it's never doing nine. Right. So let's say it starts with yours. Okay. Is your player one? Yeah. Um, okay, well, it's about to start over. Ready? No, because I have to get to the train oh, thing. But... It's an escape room puzzle is what this is. All right, so. Uh, oh, wait, yours? No, 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 hold on. Yours says six, though. And you don't have any 12s in yours. No. All right. I think we start with mine, actually, okay. then. Because you, you can't, well, you can't gonna, do a six without I'm going to go back, to, and I'm going to put in yours as well. Yeah, go and then to I'll you, be, then I'll be able, start. I'll, I'll be able to dictate it to you. Exactly. Yeah, okay. Reset. Okay, I'm ready. Okay, hold on. It's coming around. Mm -hmm. Get ready. It's up, yeah. mm -hmm. right, up, 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 right, down. Okay. Yes. Ready? No, obviously not. I need to get back oh, to right. the train station. Of course. Um, so I will go to the train station, and you'll tell me what we did. Okay. You ready? Yes. Up, right, up, up, up. 
right uh -huh. down. Okay. Okay. And now I will go to the to the clock store. And the second half was right, 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 down, right, down, down, right. Perfect. Now don't go anywhere. It's lit up, so I think that's promising. Yeah. Don't go anywhere. Okay. Dictate to me. Uh, where are you? I'm, I'm ready to input the second half of the code. Yep. Okay, so you're there. Yeah. You, you just went down. So right, right, mm -hmm. right. Yep. Down, right. Mm -hmm. Down, down, right. There we go. Yep. Cool. On to the train. Choo choo. Chapter three. It was easier than I thought to extract time from animals. Now I had to learn how to do the same with people. Chapter three. I knew Lerka wouldn't want to harm the people who went out into the clock. Sorry, who went into the clock. So I decided to give them a way out. Amelie, you seem a little bit sinister. Yeah. So we've moved to 1937. Mm -hmm. Oh. Fancy. Oh, wow. There are hanging light bulbs. There are hanging light bulbs. I can turn them the train on. The station is very fancy. When I turn the light bulb on, a corresponding light on the gate lights up. Oh, yeah. And they're all throughout the entire circle, so. Mm -hmm. Well, let's see. Well, clearly that unlocks the gate, because I can't get through it right now. Yeah. So, the uh, I'm going to go in the house. House first? Okay. So there's a telephone. Uh-oh. I've got a telephone, too. Hmm. I've got five, six, seven, eight, nine, plus, and squiggle. I have one, two, three, four, zero, asterisk, pound sign. And that's all I can do right now. Yep. Let's see. In the post office, I have a, t uh, I, um, now I have the a Morse code thing. Oh, I've got a note. As the note says, I am so excited to restore the clock shop with you, Lerka. Soon we are going to be a proper family again. Meet me at the basement of the shop. Mm. So I have a Morse code thing here. I can do dots and dashes on. But you don't have any things explaining it. I've got the the post boxes, but that was 26 that was open, I think. So into Raven's Clocks. Okay. It's dark. Yeah, and in dark. the basement, I've got a wild machine with lots of weird buttons on yes. it. Yes. Uh, the buttons are base. Well, I have a raven, a wolf, a moth, a girl, a keyhole, an hourglass, a train track, a gear, a snake, then an off and an on. All right. I think I have those same symbols, but they're uh, in different orders. So okay. keyhole's in the middle. Oh yeah, the keyholes in the middle, and the the uh, the, the ones on the uh, outer edge are all in a like a slot. Yeah. And so, what do you have at the top right? Top right, I have a moth. Okay. So, and then, all right, I can't move them. See if no, I, I can't move them. When I click them, they 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 click. But oh, I turned it on, and they move around. And there's a three... oh, they do three, two, one. Raven. It said Raven? Well, I, I, and then dot, dot, dot. I got three, two, one, dot, dot, dot. And then they're in a different position oh. now. Well, uh, hold on. Let's let's try that again. Three, two, one. It's a Raven. I'll click the Raven. And then it's a dot, dot, dot. Wrong. So you had to be hitting the right ones. Let's try that again. Three, two, one. Raven, and then a dot, dot, dot. Snake. Um, snake. Uh, fuck, fuck. Where's the snake? There it is. Okay, four. 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 The number four. The number four. What does number four mean? I don't know. None of these are number four. All right, I hit Raven. You hit snake. All right, sorry. I hit Raven and got snake. Yeah. You hit snake and got four. Yes. I'm gonna. All right. Well. I don't so, know what four is. So we try it again. Okay. Three, two, two one. one. So Raven. 
Uh, snake. Snake. Seven. Seven? Nope. Seven? Mm -hmm. The numeral seven. Maybe it means the thing that's in position seven? If it's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine? Could Maybe. be. Let's let's try it again. That's a moth. Let's see if it's a moth again. Seven for me. No, no, it's it's my seven, oh, okay. All right. which is railroad track. Okay, let's see if it's railroad track. It's again. Okay, ready? Let's begin. Yours should know what mine's at. Yeah, hold on. So it's it's a raven. A raven, snake. Snake. Eight. No, nope, it said no. I hit railroad tracks and it said no. What was your so what's your eight now? It's moth again. Okay, so it's gonna be moth. So when yeah. it says seven just, yeah. or eight, just tell me what's in yeah. your eight mm -hmm. position. Here we go. Okay, so raven. Snake. Snake. Moth. Uh I got an X. No, I had to do a moth, then it's a dot dot dot. Yeah, then no no. Mo moth, no, moth no, was, Mikey, yeah. Mikey, Mikey. Mm -hmm. You get Raven. I click Raven, it tells me snake. I also click Raven. What happens if alright. Like if I start and I say Raven, but I don't click it. And I click snake. Snake is wrong. I have to click the thing it's, it says on my screen as well. Okay, I only get a dot 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 after Raven Snake. So the dot 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 is when I'm waiting to hear what to click from you. But if I see an icon on my screen, like for example, let's let's start again. Okay. So it's Raven, and then Snake, and then Moth, and then I'm waiting for some input. Okay. Well, we'll see. So. So, raven, snake, and moth. I have dot, 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 so I'm going to put in moth, mm -hmm. and now it says five, which is a uh, keyhole. Okay, all right. I don't know why that didn't work last time, then. So, raven, snake, moth, keyhole. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's wolf plus two. That's uh, hourglass. Keyhole, hourglass. Key four, mm -hmm. up from four is going to be uh, settings, like cog. Yep. Mm -hmm. Diagonally down from six, that's uh, train track. Train track. Uh, three is a uh, girl. Girl. Uh, bug. Um, I guess that's the moth again. Slither is snake. Four up. One, two, three, four. It's the wolf. Wolf. Uh, okay. Six is bird. Bird. Okay. Six is snake. Uh, keyhole. Keyhole. Machine. I guess that's the cog. This one. Snake. Snake. Uh, eight. Uh, diagonal up. Raven. Raven. Okay. Escape. Escape. Um, what is keyhole? Keyhole. Yes, we yes. got it. Okay, now. Whew. So we have south and southeast. I've got two northeasts. XX, northeast, northeast. Yeah, I got south and southeast. Where is okay. your... Um, you've got south and southeast. Now, yeah. I've got a uh, little... Um, two little, um, you know, needles pointing on, a, on yeah. gauges yeah. and they're both pointing to where it says northeast, exactly where the X's are. Yeah, it's ditto for me. My, one, one needle's at south, one, one needle's between south and east, so. Oh, so yours are at two different spots. Your yeah. X's are two different spots. I have spots. south, southeast. Kay. And you have northeast, northeast. And I've got... So there's two circles around northeast, west, and south on the compass. One of them just goes beyond the points and one of them is just before the end of the points. Okay. Is that the same for you? Yes, but the inner circle doesn't have anything on it. Oh, where are your X's? They're both on the outer circle. Oh, so mine, I have one on the inner and one on the outer. All right. That might be to show that they're two X's, because otherwise they'd be superimposed. So northeast, northeast, south, and southeast. Mm -hmm. Okay, so that's a, that's a code for... Oh, the lights are on upstairs now. Oh, yeah. There's, oh, a, there's radio. a radio. All right. Let's find some messages. We've done this game before. Three patients from the nursing home in Hilbick have vanished in the middle of the night. Amelie, what did you do? The talented Amelie Raven has returned from Switzerland. She is... Determined to reopen and bring back glory to Raven's clocks. Oh, my. The police are looking for anyone who is in the vicinity of the nursing... Home yesterday evening. They're asking for assistance finding the missing patients. Oh, no. The post office's water damage is repaired, and all post boxes are ready. To be used again. There's already a letter in post box 34. 34, you say. Okay. Mm -hmm. The tragic comic... Sorry, the tragic nursing home incident has reopened old wounds in our village. We, 
Hope these disappearances won't remain unsolved like those five years ago. Oh my, we have no news when our train station will re return to our village again. The so station train service. The train. The station is now permanently closed. Okay, that's that. There's one more. No. The very end of the dial. Yep, there is. Oh yeah, sorry. Clarissa Shar, the generous benefactor of our new clock tower, died last month. At the opening ceremony next week, we will honor her memory. Oh. Do you remember who that is? Yes. Yes. So if we go to the post office... Mm -hmm. What was it? 34, I believe it was? Well, I just have a I just have a Morse code machine. Yeah, but I've... I have no... Uh, yeah, it was 34. And it was southeast and south and north. Oh, and Jackson. Northeast. Oh, this game. What a delight. I'm sorry if that's been there for a while without me noticing it. Hey, Jackson. How's <laughs> it going? you played it before, Jackson? Uh, yes, this has been a complete delight. We had only, only had to look up one thing. Um, post office telegram is inside of that thirty-one. Okay, oh, telegram, perfect. Because I need, a, I have a, I have a Morse code machine here. Good. It feels like I was gone for such a long time, but for all the time I was away, it still felt short, too short to finish my invention. Now we will have the longest lives ever, longer than you could imagine. When you've repeated this message. I'll guide your way. So there's shorts and longs. So how many? Tell me about the shorts and longs. It feels like I was gone for such a long, long. time, mm -hmm. but for all the time I was away, it still felt short, too short, to finish my invention. Now we will have the longest lives ever, longer than you could imagine. When you've repeated this message, I'll guide your way. There we go. And uh, it turned the light bulb on. Okay. And I don't know what else though. Which light bulb? What does the light bulb situation look like? It's um. Well, it's off, uh -huh. and for the the shorts, it it's um makes a small light for the longs it makes a bright light mm -hmm. short long short 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 long short sorry long you don't have a you don't have any machine do you May, oh, hold on a second maybe 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 i have to use it again let's see well i'll let it start over ready okay. no i can't i can't I can no longer send messages. So it's it's giving me a series of short uh, of of dots and dashes. Okay. So let's take let's just record what those are right now. Okay. Well, let, uh, I'm gonna let them start over because it's halfway through right now. Mm -hmm. I give it Luckily, I it, it it won't for it doesn't repeat on its own. I have to initiate it. Are you ready? No. No. Okay. Why are you being a jerk? There we go. That's okay. Jackson played it last year. I remember nothing of the story. <laughs> Amelie seems like uh, trouble, like a prob problematic yeah okay ready yeah okay let's go okay short long short 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 long 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 short long long short so it's a 12 three three clusters of four well, that looks like actual Morse code, frankly. Mm -hmm. So let me see if I can find a quick Morse code decoder. Although so far everything has been, well, more or less everything has been in the uh, in the thing. Lamp is how that spells out. Lamp. Lamp. Well, that's handy. And the lamp will guide your way. Well, that seems obvious, but... I mean, is it the hanging light bulbs? Well, okay, but what what does it need to be? Well, there are six... So there are four... Hmm. I'm not sure. Oh, oh hold there's... up. <coughs> 
if you go into the phone, if you go in the house to the yeah, phone. Yeah, I forgot about the phone in the house. Yeah. Uh, if you hit each of the numbers mm-hmm. and buttons, they... Oh! Uh, yeah, words. Yeah. So, so what, one is, was pouring down and made me scared. Okay. Which is not the start of anything. Two is, hey, Lerka, I'm so glad you finally... Oh, that sounds like a start. Three is, earlier, but you... Never mind. Are you still? Okay. Four is... Know that before I left, I made you something to keep. Okay. Zero is, you named Cole. I made a new one for you. Okay. And that's, I, I ran out of space. Asterix is, you so many messages. Wait, I know you're still. And the hashtag is, can know it's not the same, but please just go see for. Okay. So uh, what was that one that started like, it sounded like it was the beginning? Two. Hey, Lerica, I'm so glad you finally. So I'm glad you finally... Dis- All right, so two is... Hey, Lerica, I'm so glad you finally... Seven is... Decided to pick up the phone. I've been leaving... There was messages. There's some that one that began, began messages. I've huh? been leaving... Um, no. I've been leaving... Um, oh, well, where was it? Um, you so many messages. So Which that's number? a pound sign. Pound. No, not pound sign. I'm sorry. Asterisk. Star. Star. Asterisk. Okay. So... I've been leaving you so many messages. Wait, I know you're still. Five is angry. Okay. Uh, but don't hang up on me yet. I really want to. I really want to. Um, nope. I really want to. Um really want to want to really want to mm, no none of these make sense I oh, sorry I really want you to I really want you to I really want you to know that before I left I made you something to keep right that's What's four it? that's four okay I made you something to keep mm-hmm um, and there's a period. Uh, nope. Uh, so what is there? There's nothing. There's no punctuation at all. Know that before I left, I made you something to keep. Um, okay. To keep. You company, nine. Okay, nine. I would have told, now it'll be easier because we, um, they're all things that we haven't seen before. Yeah. I would have told you would have told you earlier but you dot 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 never mind are you still that's three there this is so that was three yeah and i've got tilde mm-hmm. so i think we're gonna have to enter the codes our sides in the order that they're in there's okay. tilde uh are you still there you know your raven that went missing the one uh pound sign no i'm sorry wrong uh zero yes you named cole I made a new one for you, comma. That's a zero. Uh, uh, I guess eight. It's upstairs. And it's even better. This one cannot die. Period. Huh. I don't have anything else. Yeah, I think that might be it. We one, never two, used one three, at all. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Now that's all of them. So now enter. So you enter, Mikey. Yeah. Two. Mm-hmm. Asterisk. Uh-huh. Four. Mm-hmm. Three. Mm-hmm. Zero. Okay. And pick up the phone if you there you go. There we go. And a ladder came down. Seven five. Nine till day eight. Well, there's a Bunch of diagrams on the wall, two candles, uneven heights. Okay, so now up. I've got a bird cage with a mechanical raven in it, and the letters ZZZ hmm. as a code that I think I can adjust. Yeah. Oh God. Okay. So I can. It goes. It goes through the Danish alphabet. Ah. So there's lots of fun letters there as well. well. All these mechanical diagrams. Only one of them seems usable, but. Um, okay. Does it have a name on it? No, none of them have names. But this one has um, a clock. 
Okay. With 12, 3, 6, and 9. Uh-huh. And then a bunch of, uh, I guess, divots around. It's it's not it's not divided up like a normal clock. There's, there's tw- well, unless it's a 24-hour clock, there are 24 divots. Okay. Um, that's, that's the town. The town lights. Right. Correct. Um, unfortunately, it's no help because they're all identical looking. All of them are kind of half moons. Um, sure. We're looking and then for, there's a okay. there's a Morse code thing on one side. Oh, what does that say? It doesn't say anything. It's just a Morse code machine. Oh, like well, that, it's, we it's a have picture used of the machine earlier. Yes. Okay. And then the other side is a mechanical raven's head. Anything on the head? No, it's just a mechanical raven. You can't interact with it. Nope. If I click it, it just goes back to the wall. And what happens if you click on the Morse code machine? No, nope, just goes back to the wall. I mean, I click anywhere on the drawing, it just go small again oh, i can I make all the drawings big but all the other ones i don't see any way they could be useful hmm there's nothing with three letters no this lovely perfectly circular town Nothing at all, you say. Hmm. All right, let me go back into the Raven's Clocks. And I can go downstairs. And no, that's all that thing. We've already solved that. That all looks tapped from my end. Hmm. And yep, so we go into the post office. And I think on my end that looks tapped as well. Let's see. Yep. So okay, I think we're really down to left to your um, to your mm-hmm. things to your to your. Let me look at them. Okay, this is the one. Okay, what did the rest say? The rest, I don't think, are going to be very useful. This. There's a 46. Uh huh. Just gears. There's some gears. Six. That is an A, I guess. Seven, two, 32.4. And B, X, C, X. Okay. And if anything, nothing happens if you deal with that uh, Morse code tapper. Well, that's not a Morse code tapper, but... Yeah, it is. No, this is... It's a router of Morse code, isn't it? I don't think so. Can you turn the crank? No. And the candles don't do anything? And let's see that again. See that one. Tapping I mean, that way, birds that way. Yeah, and the, there's arrows right. on this circle. Yep. So there's south, southeast, northeast. That uh, doesn't appear to be anything. Now you've got the uh, you've got the tappy tappy machine over on your th- in my in um, your post, post office. office. Yes. So what is it there? Well, that gave us that code we haven't used yet. Right. And what was that code we haven't used yet? I thought you wrote it down. <sighs> well, we did. It said lamp. Yeah, the lamp will guide you. It was there were twelve iterations of short and long. Right. And I dictated them to you. Yeah, and they spelled out lamp. Well they spelled out lamp, right. So there's nothing else that, that can do. No. Okay. Raven's clocks. I can't remove those bits. The lamp will guide you, I mean. There's a lamp hanging off the chain in the basement in the house, but it's not interactable. Mm-hmm. Well, I'm just going to go through... Was there something in the radio that we missed? I don't think so. It's mostly story. Telling I don't us... think we get the raven's name there. No, Cole is the raven's name. Of the, old, the old raven, not the mechanical one. So clearly we need to be turning on some of these light bulbs to get the gate. Oh yeah, but we need to 
open. Figure that out first. I think we need to open up. So the... there, there are the same number of light bulbs as there are. Um, There's twenty four light bulbs as there are uh, things in this drawing. Yes, but unfortunately, and it indicates that in one direction, at three o'clock is the Ravens thing, and at yeah. nine o'clock is the post office, which we know. Mm -hmm. I believe that's right, anyways. Is that right? Mm. No, the house is at nine o'clock. Mm. Well, either way. I mean, it's bisecting it into halves. Yeah. Oh. Anyway. I still feel like what we need here mm -hmm. is the name of the raven, or the code for the raven to unlock its cage. Well, how many letters? Three. Cole. K-O-L. Was it K-O-L? Yeah. The raven you named Cole. I made a new one for you. I don't remember that part. Was oh. that in your messages? Yeah, I read it out loud to you. Well, okay, that's, I not, how I, I, that's I, not how I would spell coal. <laughs> so. I, I, I told you that it's, their even name was coal a few minutes ago. I know, ago. but that's still not how I would spell well, it. And you said it was the alive one, and so I assume maybe there's a thing with the dead well, one. Did you try so yes, now I've entered it, and the raven has woken up. Okay, there we go. And I'm clicking on it, and its lights are turned on. And, oh, it may be making some noises. There we go. Hey. <laughs> I gotta see this. I love ravens. That's not as good as the real one. Short, long. Short, long. 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 Short, short, long. 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 Short. Okay, but I need to write that down. So <laughs> let's try it again. Let's try that again, Mikey. Mm-hmm. You're writing it. Mm-hmm. Short, long, short, long. Short, long, short, long. Short, long, short, long. Long, long. Short, short, long, long. Wait. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Okay, that's actually mm -hmm. twelve. And then how many letters were in? There was also twelve in the code for math. Yes. Mm -hmm. So, my theory will be... That longs are light and... Yes. Oh, and, the, and of course, because uh, that makes sense, because uh, this half is the uh, Morse code. Look, this half is the Morse yeah, code. Yeah, yeah, exactly. And this half is the raven. So we got to start at... Short. All right, so let me try this. Okay. Well, I guess we could both try it at the same time. Mm -hmm. Where are you starting? Starting at the train station and okay. going clockwise, right? That yeah. was what it said on this thing? Mm -hmm. All right, I'll have to double check. Oh, okay, well, sure. I mean, it's turning clockwise. I'm starting with the raven from the, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I think that's how it's going to be. Because okay. when you point at the at the um, train station here at 12 o'clock, mm -hmm. on okay. the old thing, anyways. Okay. And also on the little uh, dial yeah. on the board. Although... Does the raven start on the right hand of the train yeah. station? Yeah. Okay. So, so what, what do we have? The fifth light on the train station mm -hmm. is what we're lighting up. Okay. And everything else should be black. Yep. Then on the next screen, mm -hmm. with the house, yep. it's short, long, long. So off, on, on. Yep. No, sorry. It's a long, long, short. No, it's long, long, long. And then sh short, short, long. So one, two, three, and six should be yep. up. Mm -hmm. And then we're at the post office. And then we're at office. the post office, and that'll start with long, long, short. Mm -hmm. And then short, long, short. So okay. one, two, and five are lit up. Mm -hmm. Then we're at the clocks. Short, short, long. Mm -hmm. Long, long, short. Mm -hmm. So three, four, five. Yep. 
And then short, long, long. Oh, sorry, long, long, short. And that works. There we go. The gate is open. We did it. In we go. Okay, there's a lamp. There's a lamp and some wood. Mm -hmm. And a ladder. And a ladder. I pulled down. Oh, and then this says, my last memory of Lerka was the suspicious frown on her face. Did you get any words when the ladder came down? No, the ladder hasn't come down. Well, you have to touch it. Oh. Yes, I got some words. Okay. All those years in Switzerland made it possible for me to finally finish the clockwork. And I can scroll up. Mm -hmm. And there's another ladder. Mm -hmm. That one comes down. Go ahead and read it. I double-checked Lerka's clock. It ran exactly as it should. At first, she didn't want the clock. She said she was tired of my presence. And then we can go up. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> it didn't occur to me that a crack in the clock face would make a difference. Oh. I held it out to her anyways because I needed her to be with me. Ooh. There are jars with numbers on them. Yes. I don't know if we want to record them. I can always come back, I guess. Um, I had spent years collecting time for us, time that would be added to our lives. I never told her that the time was stolen, only that the clock would let us be together forever. More jars. More jars. Don't need to write them down just yet. Instead, she disappeared into the clock. I still haven't found her. She closed her hand around the clock, and I never saw her again. And now there's a lot more jars and one jar with a blank label. Yep, and I clicked on the blank one and... Uh, it opened up and a blue shimmering thing went into it. Uh-huh, and now the number has gone on to it. It's 86. 80 for me. Okay. Is that our score? <laughs> no, I think that's just our souls. I didn't have to build a way out. I hope you and your friend appreciate it. <laughs> you beat the game. Such a shame to see all that time go to waste. You have lost 86 minutes of your life. You have lost 80 minutes of your life. That was what the number was. <laughs> Lerka would have added 80 minutes to hers. Amelie added 86 minutes to hers. Oh, man. And now... That's right, because I had Amelie's clock. You had Lerka's clock. Yes. A and game by go. Other Tales Interactive. That's the game. Cute. I like the aesthetic. All right, scooch over a little bit. Supported by Spildordningen, the Danish Film Institute, The Game Scheme, Coffee Stain, Asker Lindpulsen, Stefan Hanna, Daniel Lundvall, Tanya Tankred, Mira Dorte. And the rest. Ah, oh, boy. Very good. Um, it's literally a time sink. It is literally a time sink. I, um... I don't know if anybody's still out there. And that's that. Hey, Jackson. That. What did you think of that game? It was um, interesting. Um, it made me <laughs> it reminded me of Mist, but better. Obviously, I guess. Games have come a long way since then. But, like, it's an atmospheric, um, like, uh, puzzler. But, like, the, the, the puzzles are much better than in Mist. Like, they made sense and you could solve them. It was nice to be able to have the internet to translate Morse code for us. Yeah, and to, to help with that one um, that one uh, puzzle where we got a little stuck. <sighs> I don't remember what it was. Oh, right, right, right. It was because we hadn't thought about the numbers in the code. Like, uh, you know, the two kittens you found in the pantry. I mean, it's hit pantry twice. Yeah. So that's possible. Are we, are we going to beat each other up? Yeah, I thought we'd beat each other up a little bit. Do you, do you need a controller? I'm going to need a controller, but that's okay. Uh, we're going to switch up the game a little bit. Tick tock on the clock. DJ, blow my speakers up. Oh, I still have a drink left. Oh. Just might as well have a little silly punch him up. I'm wearing my Cassandra Complex t-shirt because I couldn't afford an actual painting of hers. Ten bonus points if you know who Cassandra Complex is. I don't think many will, but if you've if you're a very particular kind of homosexual, you may. Is the other controller under here? Oh. Well, 
Great. That's a very helpful answer, Mikey. Well, I literally don't know. I meant asking you to look, but that's fine. Huh. For a completely different... Sorry. For a completely different uh, change of pace here. Do you want to explain this game, Mikey? Uh, it's like a fighting game where you're... You can, you're, the character you control is very floppy and very difficult to control, and that's what makes it fun. Uh, where is the damn other controller? Wow, that's really loud in my ears. Keep talking, Mikey, while I look for it. Keep talking, Mikey. Oh, I should turn down the volume on desktop audio now. I did, I just did. Okay. It looks like it's reasonable, but of course Jackson or whoever else might be watching. Can tell us otherwise. Ah, uh, yes. So it's been a very busy day here at Megaphonic Headquarters. Um, I tidied our backyard, which was deeply in need of it, and I cleaned out our fridge, which was deeply in need of it. And um, my bed sheets are in the washer. I'm going to put them in the dryer as soon as we finish the stream, so I'll have nice bed sheets to sleep in tonight. And I just, in general, feel very accomplished. Which is a weird way for me to feel. It's not how I normally feel day to day. Well. Oh. What? Oh my God, my mitts. I f I forgot I had I forgot I owned these. Huh. Cause you're gonna get us. I know. You're gonna get me in trouble. Well, oh, they're so nice though. Well, there you go. Here, no, that's not it. As a Newfoundlander. The, the hunting of seal for both um, warmth and food is part of my heritage. Not endangered or anything? Not in the least bit endangered. There's more than 6 million around Newfoundland and there's only 500,000 people. Um, and, you know, it's the sort of thing where, like, if you... If you're a vegetarian, it would make sense not to like it. But if you will have a ham sandwich, it's like, well, those those pigs were treated much worse. I am very bad at vamping. Also, I cannot play this game at all while wearing these. Can't believe Chris found my sealskin mittens. While looking for a controller to play this game, I also can't believe the controller isn't just here. Like, why would it not be right here? Does not make sense. Oh, goodness. I also had quite... There we go. Where, where was it? No, it's a different one. They inherit. Well, I certainly can't play while wearing these. <sighs> the pardon. I had a crazy leg day today, which was good. And so at this point, my legs feel all weak and watery, which is lovely. The best feeling. All right, local. Well, you're not here. There you are. 
I think I need to be the granny. What am I? What am I? What is? Oh, there it is. Oh, ah. there I go. Ah, ah, ah. Sorry. Ah. Stop that. No. What are you doing? I, I was. I'm just hitting the B button by accident. How All are right. you changing your body or your color? I'm using the analog stick. So am I, but it's I'm I'm just always red. I'm not changing my color. Oh, that's true. Could be a luchador, a penguin, just a normal guy, a pirate. Oh right. Oh hold on. Uh eight. Melee random. That all sounds good. Okay. Submit. I don't remember the controls at all. There's punch and grab and m moving. All right. I am a granny. You certainly would not harm a granny. In the Beef City Aquarium? No. Where am I? Let's jump. Let's jump. Get away from me, young man. Young man, get away from me. Oh my goodness, tentacles. Take that! And that! <laughs> oh, look! Oh god, he's escaping. Oh, good. Oh, there's, we're stuck. What you mean we? How do I get out? How do I get out? You gotta grab onto things with your... Um, well, I don't know how. Right shoulder buttons. Right, right left shoulder, I think. Okay, that's how you grab onto things? Okay. That's just... Uh, I guess we should confirm. Is there a way to do that? Pause? Check the... Alright. Uh -huh. Pause? No? Oh yeah. Okay. <laughs> That's all yes. it took. I decided to get you out of the ring. Mm. I'm crushing you. <laughs> okay, over to Vince. I'm gonna maybe turn the music up a little bit more. I can't tell. If I knew what my fucking controls were. That's too bad. Whatever. fighting games. Do you want me to destroy you and smash after this? Not hooked up. I enjoy will... beef, Mikey. I do enjoy beef. <laughs> ah! <laughs> There's a basketball uh, at our feet now. Oh, good. Ouch. Finally, I get on the board. Man, you really giggle a lot. Are you pressing buttons to make that happen? Really what? When you're really making that, like, dumb giggle sound. You don't like my giggle sound? No! <laughs> oh. No, I think we're both doing it. I don't know how to climb up. I'm holding on. But... You gotta grab arm by arm. You gotta quap up. I'm trying. You gotta lift up your arms. How? Which button is that? Why? Well, that was annoying. Red one? Oh, that's me. Wait, no, you're red. Yes. 
How did you win? Mm. I... I... I don't understand. Maybe we needed to both be on the other train. Okay. Oh, well, this one. <laughs> I really don't know what's causing that. Hey! <laughs> one simple headbutt. Oh. Unfair. It's true, that was me that time. They were the worst. Melee gondola. Take that. You want to take me alive, copper. <laughs> but I'm a luchador. I don't know. <laughs> oh, Kingsley. <laughs> oh, you, you, let go of me. Oh. Unhand me, woman. I don't want cookies no! today. Oh, I fought so well. <laughs> died so well. I tried so hard and I got so far, but in the end it didn't really matter. <laughs> I don't remember this one. We can just enjoy a nice ride. I'm just enjoying a nice ride. Isn't this lovely? Uh, this is just a lovely game. Chunder wheel. I love chunder. When I was a girl, I used to chunder all the time. Chanda, chanda, chanda. I feel like some action may be missing. Oh, what a lovely ride that was. How dare you, sir? Sirrah, I shall not see this. Ah! Oof. Banger again. Ah! <laughs> oh god! Oh, there once was a man who clung to the sea, and the sea did not. Oh no! 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 I don't know where I am. I think we're both dead. Blue winds. <laughs> <laughs> Slightly. Slightly. I don't know if I got a bubble for that, actually. Oh no, I hate this one. You always go for grabs. Fuck. Well, for that reason. Why do you always grab onto me and throw me off a thing? You punch! It's more fun. I know. But grabbing is good too. Learn boundaries. It's a fighting game, Mikey. You were the one who entered this death sport against a luchador. Oh, 
Come on, let go. Shant. I have you. No, maybe I have you. Go. I don't know how to throw you once I have a hold of you, though. Yeah, let go. how long your grip will hold. Wow, that was flexing. You just pulled yourself up all the way with one arm. You're just showing off. <laughs> all those years of quapping. Keep on quapping in the free world. Ah, shit. <laughs> I got trapped. That's right. Keep on rocking the free world. <laughs> oh my! Oh, whoa! <laughs> That's our kitten crying. I don't know if that was audible on the mic. She then brought us a little mouse to play with. She wants to play too. Melee grind. Oh, the grind level. What are you doing? I'm trying to climb up here. Ah. That's not where you're going to die. Just get to your death, woman. No. Look. I've lived this long. I'm not going to let you take me down. Please, I'm taking you down more often than... Jesus, will you just, oh, frig, fall into the, no, 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 you need to be renewed, reused, and recycled, oh, come on, this is not Logan's Get run, to the recycling not place. Logan's run, you've had your day, no, 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 okay, boomer, okay, boomer, ha, ah, not okay, <laughs> not okay, How does it feel? How does that feel? Unjust. Unlike this. Yes! Jump into your own death. It makes it much easier. Fine. <sighs> Once more I shall... Damn it! Damn it! Let No! No! Stop! Stop it! 
That's right. No. Ah, let go of me! How dare you! <laughs> let go of the wall. That's right. Ah! In. Oh, you in. want in? You want in? I'm just trying to make this happen. I don't know why you're being so difficult about it. Ah! No. <laughs> no. No! Get up! Get up! Get, get up. up! There you go. <laughs> Come on. Let go. Let go. <laughs> this is ridiculous. <gasps> ah! There we go. Come here, you. 30 seconds. Get in there! What happens if we don't kill each other? Nothing. They don't, like, determine yeah, who got the most hits yeah. in or whatever. No, I don't think so. It's, a, it's just a do, do or die, Mikey. Winner take all! No! No! Shant! Come on. There we go. Draw! That did feel like a true draw. I mean, that was a draw, Mike. <laughs> yes. That was not flying. I said it felt like a true draw. Okay. You're, it's eight to win, right? So yeah, yeah, so we're pretty close. Okay, the shoots oh would God, this open one. up. Yes. Let me out of here. No. Ugh. <laughs> wow. Wow, such disrespect to your elders. Oh, you're the one who taught me and told me to punch. Wow. <laughs> I'll just sit here and wait. Oh, look, there's things. Yeah, watch out for the wang meat. <laughs> How dare you, sir? That's right. God, the controls are so wonky. Get down and stay down. That's right. That's right. Holding each other. 
Like two survivors of a shipwreck. Just like at the climax of Middle March. That's right. Go in the hole. You know you wanna. No! No! Why won't you go into the hole? Young man, do as you're told. I am. My job was to take you and put you in the hole. You said take out the trash. I'm taking the trash out. You just punched me. No! No! Oh. <laughs> Finally. Well... Alright, I can't let you catch up. That would be no good. That would be no good indeed. Okay. Big towering nuclear thingy thing. Oh, this seems, um... This seems problems. Ha <laughs> ha! Oh, for a second I thought I had an easy win. Yeah, you thought. I thought. Oh! <laughs> Damn it! <laughs> That's right. Are we now neck and neck? Uh, How you're still you? one ahead. Okay. Oh, my eyes are itchy. Well, I was driving today and I scratched my eye and my contact got dislodged and that was terrible. That's Luckily, nice. I was able to put it back in by just sort of rubbing my eye a few right, more times. Subway. But... <laughs> well, I'm quite blind and losing vision in one eye while driving would be a real bad scene. <laughs> No! No! That was Dang pretty it. dangerous. Oh, uh, so close. Uh oh. Is it get up, get up, get up, get up, get up? You're almost there. You're almost there. Come on. Come on. Oh, here it comes. Damn it. <laughs> I'm out of breath. <laughs> what did you do? I don't know. Okay. This is for all the beans. Oh, man. How did this happen? My beautiful I, get, I get better when I do things. Whereas I am always perfect. <laughs> Ah, oh, you! Whenever I pick you up, you always end up holding onto me. Well, yeah. It makes the whole like pick up and throw like game very, very unviable. We're holding hands. We're best of friends. That's it. Give! Give! Oh. <laughs> now it's like we're dancing. A really weird kind of dance. Oh, he's gonna do it! He's gonna do it! No! Oh. 
Damn it. Why did I hold on to that? This is unexpected. <sighs> That's frustrating. Well, I, I don't have a speech prepared. I'm sorry, Chris. I feel bad now. It's okay. You hate me. Uh, obviously. That's wow. how games mean. That's how that works. It's very important well, to yeah. invest lots of real-world emotion into it, and indeed. Well, this has been the show. <laughs> oh, did you drink your drink that I brought you? Yeah. Okay. I don't actually hate Chris. I have a little bit left. Oh, my eyes are killing me. All right, friends. This has been everything. I'll be up in the morning for uh, Crosswords. Uh, thanks for hanging out, for those of you who did. And hope everybody has a great night of it. Bye, everyone. Thanks for coming.